Welcome back, guys. Sorry I ended the freaking thing right in the middle of this fight. This guy's a son of a bitch, though. Oh. What? That will be all. Thou didst me good service. What? What is he doing? Why is he doing it? What, to get the power of the I've beast? I've given thee courtesy enough. <laughs> yep, he absorbed the beast's essence, I guess. Okay, this guy is not happy. Come on, Mimic, get in there. Get in there, boy. Damn. Come on, Mimic, get him. Crap. Oh my... How? He has no health left. Explain to me how that even happens. That is so annoying. That is so annoying. So very, very annoying. Okay, I only have a split second to summon my Mimic when I get in there, so, um, real quick. Come on, summon, summon. Okay, I forgot I need to take off that pacifying one so that... Dang it. Come on, Mimic. There we go. Get him, Mimic.
crap. Gotcha. Did it. All right. Horror Lau. Horror Lou. Sorry. Let's go. We did it. So now the next part is to fight Radigan of the Golden Order. And the only way to burn that down, I mean, we could have opened this through um, the Frenzied Flame, I'm pretty sure. But we didn't even need the Frenzied Flame. That, and that's for if you don't want to use the Frenzied Flame. <laughs> Touching the Golden Light is going to bring us into that fight. I totally forgot, guys, that I started a new video, but I... Um, I'm just going to try a few times. I think I'm only doing a half hour video for this. But yeah, we're going to fight Radigan and the Elven Beast. We got a hell of time, our, have our timing timed in this. Yeah, see, that's supposed to be the top of the Elden Ring. He was supposedly the one who shattered it. That's why none of the great runes look like that. Like that top part. And that's supposed to be Marika. Uh, she's supposed to be the one that's holding the uh, Elden Ring. But because of what Radigan did. I believe it was him who was in prison. Because she... Is the one who housed the Elden Ring. And I think he tried to. Or maybe I have it wrong. But yeah, he broke the, shattered the Elden Ring. That's why it's known as the time of the shattering. Radigan of the Golden Order. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Dang it. I need to be aware of that. I forgot he does lightning damage. Dang it. Okay, he's almost done. Okay, he was not that hard, but the Elden Beast is going to be harder because he's got different attack phases. And this guy is going to be a lot harder in New Game Plus, for sure. And you know what, I was watching this in another person's uh, stream, 
uh, watching him do all the boss battles. And when he did Elden Beast and Radigan of the Golden Order, you know what it was like? I was like, you know what is funny? That the Elden Beast looks like a revamp of Seed the Scaleless. He really does. Is that the... It looks like the God-Killing Blade. Oh, it's not. That's probably a weapon that does holy damage. He probably has some kind of sorcery that he's gonna teach us, or an incantation of holy... Some type of holy damage, I think. Yeah, it's like a revamp of Seat the Scaleless. I don't have enough heals. Because I didn't heal from that fight with Godfrey. Yeah, I needed to heal before this fight because it's... T oh, I just lost 30,000 souls too. I went into this fight without saving first, man. Dang it. I should have left after I defeated... Freaking... What's his name? Damn, man. So, yeah, this is going to be tough for me. To beat this guy and not die. Because now I've got to get through the Radigan fight again. in one piece, so, real quick, flame Grammy strength, double cool. you gonna show this cutscene all over again, yep, Damn it. Dang it, I didn't roll right. Dang it. That was rough.
Dang it, I wanted to pop a rune arc too. Wait, did I not pick up my souls yet? Where are my souls? Or my runes? They're not in here. Crap. Oh, that sucks, dude. I'm gonna have to beat this. Oh, there they are, way over there. Yeah, I can't lose these. That's way too many runes for me to lose. My mimic's suffering for it, though. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. So where are you going? Bro, how um, no. <laughs> Okay. This time, I'm going in with a sacrificial branch so that I can just get them and come back out. Ah, <sighs> okay. Yeah, I'm gonna just use them. Use one of them at least. I wonder if I can pick it up in the Radigan fight. Damn it, I did it. Like a freaking idiot. Okay. Yeah, they're not in here right now. Bro, I just wasted a sacrificial branch. Or you know what? I may have not I may not have had I may have lost the the souls anyway or the runes anyway because I didn't pick them up. Talisman effects to prevent runes. Okay, well, now I got to equip another one. I only got four, and I wanted to save them for the next game. New Game Plus.
You know what? I'm just gonna go in. I don't feel like wasting a bunch of time. Oh, I forgot I gotta be uploading videos right now. I totally forgot I uploaded. I can upload more right now. Let's see. Damn it. Alright guys. Sorry about the last video. Um Bro. Oh my god. Why is he so aggro on me? I wasted another twig just now. Okay, we got three left. This is so annoying. Come on, let's go. Hurry up. Damn it. I didn't need to do that. Damn it. Why is my mimic almost dead? Oh my god, you serious? I made all of them but that one. My mimic is dead. Damn, bro. Dude, I'm just getting spanked by this guy right now. Got you, Jesus criminy. Now, I just need to go through here and grab my freaking runes, but I have a feeling like I'm gonna die again. Where are they? There they are over there. Gosh damn it! Why did they have to be so far away? 
Yeah, there's no way I'm getting through this. The uh, I'm going to waste all of my twigs and then I'm going to end up losing. Yeah, I know. Thank you. Ah! And there's nobody that sells these either. They're very limited in the game. You know what? I got an idea. I am actually going to summon somebody for this fight. Red. Uh, he's doing a magic build. With this Kestis. Bulgaroth. Magic. I have a, two, a choice between two magic builds. Okay, let's we'll summon this one. Unable. Okay, let's... Unable to summon that one. What's wrong, dude? Like, why can't I summon anybody? That's weird. Oh, he's wielding dual um, scimitars. Hell yeah. All right, dog. I did. I thought I wasted a rune arc. Okay, there it is.
Got him. Damn, I am losing bad now that this guy has double health. There's no way I can beat him. Bro. That's it, that's my last heal. Well, at least I got all my runes back, so now I'm going to go and spend them like I should have done in the last fight, but I am too stupid to remember easy things like that. And I honestly need to go to bed, guys. I'm so sorry, but it's like almost midnight. Yeah, no, it's almost 11. Sorry. <clears throat> Oh, snap. I have a lot still, and I'm going to need to go get rid of them. Let's raise up our decks again. Unless I have runes. No, I don't have any runes. Uh, Remembrance of... You know what? We're going to go see what these uh, souls can give us. And depending on what they get, can or cannot give us, we're going to either pop them or just, you know, end up using them. So let's see. What, she's dead? Let's see. Malachis Black Blade. Okay, I've seen this sword somewhere before. It looks like the Moonlight Great Sword, but it's like broken and shit. Uh, what does it do? Des Destined Death. Set free the remnants of Destined Death, plunging the Great Sword into the ground and summon a myriad of blades in addition to dealing immediate damage. This attack reduces the enemy's maximum HP and continues to wear down HP for a short time. Black Blade. Caster creates an illusionary Black Blade that then leaps forward to deliver a spinning slash that emits a wave of light. This can be followed up with an additional attack. This blade was once imbued with Destined Death. In addition to dealing damage, it reduces foe's maximum HP. And continues to sap their current HP for a short, very short time. So basically, both of them do the same thing, but one's an incantation. This is 34 strength and 20 faith, but you need 46 faith to use this just as an incantation. So we're not going to use that at all. Let's see. 
the horror Lao, weapon of Godfrey, regal roar, let loose a mighty war cry, raising attack power while sending out a shockwave that cannot be guarded against by stomping the ground, while active strong attack becomes a lunging slash. It's a strength weapon. Let's see what this is. Horror lose earth shaker. Uh, slam both hands onto the ground to violently shake the earth and unleash a shockwave. Follow up with an additional input to slam the ground again. Yeah. Oh, it's an Ash of War. Yeah, we're not going to get either of those. had some info let's go talk to her now they share dialogue basically I see. Uh, so it wasn't just me this happened to to think he'd forget who you were as well I knew he'd burn himself out old Hugh I think we could talk him into leaving the round table hold now but maybe it's, it's only proper that we I'll remain with you. He made me. Who would like to return the kind? Huh. Okay. Well, let's go talk to him and see. Because they, they share a quest dialogue, so. Let's see if he has. And nope, he doesn't have anything else to say. Let's go ahead and sell that. Now, I think we might have enough to level up. Dang, so close. Oh well. We're gonna use this one anyway, but, you know, whatever. Fighting the Elden Beast is not easy. Go ahead and... Raise Arcane. It affects bleed buildup, so we'll raise Arcane. Let's go see Godfrey's office. Yeah, he's not in here anymore at all, dude. I forgot, like, we killed that guy. I thought something else might have been in there. But I do want to find out where the hell Dung Eater is, because he said he's somewhere locked up. Go and unshackle my corporeal flesh, trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. I can kill you and defile your corpse. Then the pox will truly be your own. You know what's funny about this guy? Is... He talks about being in the sewers underground. Go and unshut. Trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. I can kill you and defile your corpse. Then the pox will truly be your own. I'm wondering if he means there's that, um, uh, that area where there's like a caged area below the piping. I wonder if that's what he means. You know what? I wonder if she has other people's armor. Yep. Horror Lao. And Malekith's armor. What? This armor is pretty good actually, so let's go ahead and uh... Oh damn! That's a lot dude. That costs a lot of money just to buy them. I want to get Malekith the Black Blade stuff. Anyway, yeah, dude, this, that, that fight's gonna be tough. But, let's give it another go. Oh, we're at 40 minutes. Damn, I gotta go to bed. Here, stop messing around. Oh! So, we'll go in here. 
We'll try a couple more times. But honestly, I don't know. Um, we're gonna, you know, continue to suffer. Let's see. Let's move one. Well, yeah, let's move one over. And then we'll go ahead and equip that thing right here. Yeah, that's gonna... We're gonna take on a lot more damage. What's that? Prince of Death's Cyst. And then we got Prince of Death's Pustule. Raises vitality. Greatly raises vitality. Okay. Um, raises attack power with successive attacks. Greatly raises attack power with successive attacks. We need that on there. Successive attacks restore HP. You know what? We'll, uh, we'll switch this one with that one. We do need that other one on there, but I don't want to take anything off. Because this gives us health when we're, when we're hitting. But this lowers the FP cons uh, consumed by skills. Yeah, let's try this out. We're just going to have to use these during the fight. Or you know what? We have another... Hold on, I'm not going to even run back. I don't feel like running back. Hold on a second. I did get a better heal. Golden Vow, increased attack and, def and defense for self and allies. Golden Lightning, greatly increased lightning resistance for self and allies. Protection of the Earth Tree, increases affinity damage negation. Produces Golden Shocker that knocks back foes. Earth Tree heal. Vastly heals HP for self and nearby allies. I can't use it, but I thought I had another uh, healing one. Oh, you know what? I forgot. We need to mix the Wondrous Flask. So we'll take that off. Restores HP when near death in mixed physic. You know what? Um, boost resistance. Resistance and heals status. Here, really boost pulls. Boosts resistance and heals status. So, it allows us to heal better, I think, is what it's saying. Sadly restores HP for a time, temporarily boosts max, max HP, and then restores half. Okay, so, go ahead and use that one again. The only other thing that I can think of using is Melania's Blade, but I don't think I'll get enough licks in with it. It is stronger than the weapons I'm using. Or I could switch it with this one. But then I won't be able to do Seppuku. You know what, we're going to use this one for right now.
Good thing I didn't mean to do that. Damn it, I didn't roll right. Damn it, I didn't roll right again. Okay. Just before he killed my mimic, and I wish I had my mimic could heal though. That would be super useful. I suck at this game. The Radigan fight, we just have to keep dodging. Like, that's the only thing we can really do is just keep dodging. Oh, he got him. Damn it.
Dude, I freaking rolled. So why are you going far away on me again? Gotcha. Finally, we got the Elden Beast. Elden Remembrance. Hell yeah, we did it. What? Become the Lord of Frenzied Flame? I don't want to. I wanted to get rid of this. God damn it. Well, that's it. I the eye of the frenzied flame
Well, that's it, guys. We did it. And we did, all, we did it within one video, too. We only got, like, five minutes or four minutes left. But, hey. It's enough to see the end of this, the credits a little bit. Wow. It looks like finger prints everywhere. That looks really cool. Mmm. It's that one girl. Is that a ring? It is. Huh? Ronnie? Destined death? That's weird. Lord of the Frenzy Flame. We did it, guys. First playthrough done. Now the next one... Hide Taka Miyazaki. He is the director of From Software. Miyazaki-san. Well, we did it, guys. We beat the sea. Begin Journey 2. If you do not start over now, you can choose to begin Journey 2 later at the Table of Lost Grace in the Round Table Hold. So, I'm pretty sure that we did everything that we could. Um, as far as, you know... Um, bosses and whatnot. Like, I'm not, I'm not sure where they all are but we might have missed some but I'm pretty sure we fought all the ones that we were supposed to fight um, I'm gonna look at the trophies and see how many I have left Let's see hundred percent done with the game we hundred percent um, but not a hundred percent with trophies we did 72 percent of trophies which is cool Obtain all trophies, acquired all legendary armaments. Um, I don't know where we missed all of them, but... Acquired all legendary sorceries and incantations. Acquired all legendary tal... So guys, we've only got exactly a minute, but we're not going to go uh, into Journey 2 just yet. Uh, one of the trophies is to fight the Lich Dragon, uh, 4 to 6, so we're going to uh, fight him... And we need to get all the legendary armaments, all the legendary incantations and sorceries. But we'll do that on the next one. There's a few we'll have to do on the next playthrough. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And um, we're going to continue with maybe one or two more videos before we go into New Game Plus and start all over. Thanks for watching, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. You know, we did a lot of bosses in these last couple videos. And we, you know, finally we got through them. So yeah guys, don't forget to drop a like, it really does help when you guys like the content, and uh, we'll catch you on the next one. See ya.